Okay, Lucy Squad, so this is just a really quick video um, today, but I just wanted to post this up because I thought it'd be really important just to talk a little bit about motivation, especially as December is that time of the month where we can all feel a little bit too tired, a bit too cold, um, kind of goals, we're, we're a bit drifting, really. So that's why I just thought it'd be a really handy, quick little video to put up. So I'm going to try and keep this short and to the point. That's going to be a challenge. Anyway, so the first thing is, why not buddy up through December and just get your best friend, your work colleague, neighbour, anyone, and just sort of say for like three times a week, you're just going to meet up and do a quick little workout. If you can't meet up, you could just do it via FaceTime. You could just say, let's do a quick four minute hit workout. You can FaceTime each other and just really then commit and motivate each other. That's just a really easy tip. And, you know, tag someone in on social media. That's a great thing with social media. You know, they could live the other side of the world. It just has to be the right times. Um, and you could do, so if say you've got like my half sister, she lives in Australia, so I could tag her and say look come on let's do a workout so it might be her night time my morning or vice versa but that's a really good thing to do then the next one is set those goals I cannot tell you how important it is to have goals if we don't have goals we're just going to get drift um, we are just going to drift and goals are essential with whatever your fitness weight loss, whatever it is, you know, throughout everything in life, actually, even with your business, with relationships, you must always have goals. And don't just pick like a long-term goal, pick a goal that is gonna be also like short-term. So say, for example, if you wanted to drop a dress size in one month, and you wanted to do it the healthy way, which is the only way to do it, then I would say to you, that is your like long-term goal, but have a short-term goal each week. And that short-term goal is that you have to do five workouts and you have to really focus on healthy eating. If you do that every week, tick off that short-term goal, then every week you are getting closer to that long-term goal. And I promise you, if you do that, you're gonna easily reach that goal. It's as simple as that. So then my next tip for motivation, because it's really horrible if it's cold and wet and we don't wanna go outdoors, so you know you can get fit at home and you can turn any little tiny space into a gym at home. And you can do that by just simply getting a mat and this is the other bit that you need the other bit of equipment which is so simple is a mirror and the reason why I say a mirror is because the other day I went on a photo shoot I have um, I write for a newspaper and I had to demonstrate some exercises and I was doing some arm ones and anyway so I was doing the exercise I had both arms out and now I thought they were in a straight line but one was higher than the other and the photographer was like Lucy are you sure that's meant to be at that angle and he took a picture and I couldn't believe how much out of sync they were. Whereas if you're exercising and you're looking in front of the mirror, like I would have been able to adjust it. And sometimes when we think they're straight, they're not. So a mirror is a really good thing. You can get some really cheap ones. You can get the ones that you stick on the wall, but definitely, definitely do that. Now my next one is put on those glasses of self-belief and visualization. You have to believe, this is really important when it comes to motivation, you have to believe you can be that person you want to be. You know, we ha sometimes we listen to those voices where, you know, I think we've all done it, where we think, oh, I'm never gonna make it, I'm gonna fail, it's, you know, success is for other people it's not for me or you know where we just doubt our capability and it's a really important never to do that you have to now turn that around and think yes I can do that um, yes I am as capable as they are I've got the power in me and you have to really start visualizing where you see yourself where you want to be it sounds crazy but it is the most incredible thing when you can do that and you know I'm talking from personal experience you know I used to always kind of put myself down and and you know even though I believed in myself I was like oh no it will never ha never happened to me or I'm not good enough and actually when I turn that around it's like yes actually I deserve that and yes I am good enough and yes I can do it and I'm going to put in a hundred percent then everything completely changes. So it is so important. You so do have to believe in yourself. Then my next one is be 
an early bird in the morning. Let's get up early because we know we're going to be tempted to go to parties later on and our to-do list throughout the day is going to get longer and longer. So just a really top tip in the winter is even though it's dark in the morning, you don't have to go outdoors. Remember, you can do this at home. So just set that alarm a little bit earlier. Just get up. And remember, you don't have to do a really long workout. You could just do my four-minute workout. So literally, just get up, have your clothes so they're already over a radiator. So they are going to be lovely and snugly and warm. Then do a quick little workout and that's it. You're going to feel amazing for the rest of the day. So definitely in the winter, do it early. Um, and then I think that's it because I was determined to keep this under five minutes. I've already gone 20 seconds over. But it was just a really quick one today on just ways on how you can stay motivated when it's a little bit more challenging with the weather and with parties and what have you. But also, if you've got any ideas on motivation that I haven't put up, then don't just share it with me. But just by letting people know in the comments below, it just kind of shares with everyone and it's really nice at the moment seeing how you're all like interacting with each other and um, and I love that so I'm not even gonna ask for you to like this video because I don't really care about likes it's not about that it's just actually about me giving you good content and more than anything I just want it to be really helpful for you um, so as you probably know December is all like my how-to series and then what I'm busy doing at the moment like you can't see but on my board up there I'm working out all the workouts we're going to be doing in January because January is when you and I are going to get so fit we're going to go on the most incredible adventure in 2017. So that is it. That was quite quick ish not um i'm really tired i've had such a busy week but um all will be revealed soon and i will see you tomorrow back on my channel